thought of having this start to make it a beast team. You'd obviously get yourself on the description below, get yourself to use 7 buy, get yourself some cheap, reliable coins, and don't forget to use King with a cheeky 6% off. Right, let's get into the video. Yo guys, what's going on? King Flipper here. Welcome to another Future Stars SBC video. Today we have Frank Roycard. Uh, all right, I like to call him Ridgecard. Uh, yeah, uh, out for 60 days. It is an 89 rated CDM. Do not play him as a CDM. We'll talk about it in a sec. 80 pace, 76 shot, 82 passing, 81 dribbling, 89 defense, 88 physicality, 62 medium high, 3 star, 4 star. Can play center back. That's where you need to play this card, trust me. Uh, you, you'll see with the in game stats. 80 pace. It was okay for a midfielder, but for a centre back, 80 pace is very good. 84 vision, 90 short pass, and 86 long pass. And again, good stats for a midfielder, great stats for a centre back. Agility and balance, 73 and 70. Mm, no midfielder needs that type of mid uh, stats. You need him. You need a lot more than that for a centre mid. Uh, so for a CDM, <laughs> but for centre back stats, 88 reactions, 90 ball control, 92 composure, very great for us. Very good for a centre back stats. Uh, defending stats are off the charts. Uh, physicality stats are very good. Uh, 78 aggression as well. Whack a shadow on him. Pace and defending will be nuts. So yeah, if you are planning on doing him, especially with what he's got, he does have incisive pass, but he does have block, inter intercept plus, and anticipate. So yeah, ignore the Travella. I don't get that one. But yeah, these three stats definitely make this card a centre back card. So if you are planning on doing it, it would definitely be a centre back card. Not too many segments. We'll talk about the more expensive ones at the moment uh, in a little bit because I think they're overrated by one which we'll talk about in a sec but yeah at your born legend of course rare bronzes all 200 coins each by it now or 150 coins bid if you can get hold of them if you could be bothered to do that your 2.2k in it doesn't cost you that much you get a small silver players pack which i class as a two and a half k reward rising star rare silvers 300 coins by now or 250 coins bid if you could be bothered to do that one again 3.3k to do you get yourself a Three common gold player pack, which is still terrible. I wish we had the old ones, which was giving you two rare player packs. On alone is an 81 rated squad. Okay, now we get into it. Foot bin bite. Now price is timed in this SBC, which has been out for an hour. Bids and stops will always be cheaper. And don't forget, prices do, of course, fluctuate, especially as it's out for 60 days. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, 981s, 280s, the way to go. Your 81s, non rares, of course, the cheapest way to do it. You're looking at 600 coins by now. Uh, we'll go through nine of your cheapest. We've got Hanshaw, Shikiri. Rakitic, really, really, really. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, Pereira, Carvalho, Lehman, Ruiz. Oh, I call him Fabian, but I don't know why. Uh, Athena, uh, they're your nine of your cheapest 81s again. There's loads of them on the market. Again, 600 coins by now at this point in time. Uh, eight is a 400 coins by now. So you've got Dan and Baltran, two of your cheapest 80 rates. Happy days. Uh, between six and six and a half K to do this if you need to buy them all. I highly doubt it, but 6.2 K it's cost. So yeah, you get the loan. You can try it out again, center back. Now, this is where I was on about. These three segments should be in, I think it should be in an 84, an 85, and an 86. But, you know, you can let me know in the comments below what you think. Do you agree with me there? But, yeah. Um, top notch, team of the week. Uh, go for an 87 rated team of the week because it's an 85 rated team. 287 is 984 is the way to go. Uh, Sawloff is one of the cheapest 87 informs at the moment. You're looking at 20, ooh, no, 24k? I need to turn my page over. <laughs> uh, yeah, 24k. Yeah, 24k for your informs at the moment, which is pretty decent. 87s are fluctuating between 13.5 and, and 14k. When I was doing this, Oberdorf was 13.5k. We'll talk about them gone up a bit after. Um, and then your 84s are 2.2k, so they're nice and cheap. So you've got Brand, Madison, Don't Like Beer. Uh, Skriniak, Russo, Stanway, Ginter, Fishlock, Mateo, and Lobotka. So nine of your cheapest 84s there. They do fluctuate around around a bit, just bear that in mind. Um, 57.3k. It's not too bad considering you need an inform. So you're looking between 55 and 60k to do the top notch one. Uh, you get a, pro a premium electric player's pack, which is 20k reward. Next, we get into Clockwork Orange. Just reminds me of the if anyone's ever played the spin, uh, the roulettes, the spinners, uh, gambling. Hmm. Yeah, you know exactly which ones I'm on about. Uh, 86 rated squad with a Netherlands player. I would suggest going for an 84 Netherlands player. You got who ate all the pies or Martins at the moment. Who ate all the pies is slightly cheaper. Still more expensive than the rest of the 84s, which we'll talk about in seven, uh, second. 86 rated team, 487s, 186, 684 is the way to go. Your 87s, you've got Bronze, Big Bad Martinez, Cobble, and Odegaard at 14k each. As I said, 
The flux ran around a bit, so just bear that in mind. Uh, Mares, uh, 8.5k for their 86s. As I said, Depay is the cheapest Netherlands player. It's 84, 2.5k, so a little bit more expensive than the rest of the cards. And then your rest of your 84s are 2.2, so you've got Nadozi. Ruben Neves, uh, Kingsbury, Grimaldo, and Russo. So, yeah. Uh, 78k, so between 75 and 80k to do this SBC, which is not too bad. Uh, you get a Jumbo Premium Gold Pack, which is a 15k reward. And then the League Legend one, which is an 87 rated squad with a Syria ah, player. Um, you got options again for Serie A player. I got one for 88, one for 85, and one for 84. Uh, it's 588, 385, and 384 to do an 887 rate squad. So we got Ocean Man, uh, your cheapest 88 rate Italian league player. Uh, 20k each, along with Pop Goes the Weasel, Paredes, Renard, and Bernardo Silva. So, yes. Uh, your 85s are 5k each, Berardi, one of your cheapest Italian league players, along with Trippier and Rolling Stones. And then Small Dini, one of your cheapest 84s at 2.2k, along with Thiago Silva and Cooler Daddy. Uh, so, yeah. 121.6k to do, so between 115 and 125k to do an 87 rate squad. Again, in my opinion, a bit overpriced. You do get a Prime Electron Players Pack, so, yeah. So, for this right card, which, again, I would 100%, 1 million percent say is a centre-back card, you're looking around 270k at the moment. 268.6k to do by it now. So you're looking between 260 and 280. Uh, obviously, prices depends on how prices get on. They're quite cheap at the moment, so he is relatively cheap. But yeah, I, I, I don't. I still think it was overpriced. I think it should have been about 200k. I, I, I just he does have good stats. I, do you know what? I'm not gonna lie. I think he'll actually be really good as a centre back card. I just have that like agility and balance for a centre back is actually quite high there. Um, he's not the slowest, which is good. He is 6'2", and he? 6'2", is not too bad. He's medium high, 3'4". So his passing should be good with the vision, reactions, composure. All the other stats are very good. I do think he'd be quite a tanky at a centre-back. But it's just the risk. Are you willing to spend that much on a car that could be poo? That's why I would definitely suggest doing a loan and just trying out his five games in like a rivals game or something. You get 65k worth of rewards as well. So yeah. Comments below. Let me know what you think about this one. Again, hopefully the information helps and get you guys to save you some time and some money if you are thinking about doing it. And definitely, as I said, do it as a centre-back because he's, he's not a midfielder card stats-wise. Just the agility and balance massively let him down. So, yeah. But, yeah, hopefully it did save you some time and some money. Feel free to drop thumbs up. It does help the channel in the video. If you want to see other SBC videos like this, guys, feel free to hit that subscribe button. Make sure you got that notification bell on so you can keep up to date as soon as I upload these. But other than that, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video stream. Take it easy, obviously. Peace.